My son was unarmed. He was 17 years old. He wasn't committing any crime. Trayvon's only crime was the color of his skin. Today, a somber celebration on what would have been Trayvon Martin's 27th birthday. Earlier this week, his mother spoke exclusively to ABC's Good Morning America. Sabrina Fulton remembering her son and his picture that ignited a movement. The photo of Martin's hoodie becoming a symbol of racial injustice. Trayvon's family, activists as well, they continue to call for change. Local Times Parker Brand, he's live in Northeast Miami-Dade at a peace walk organized by the Trayvon Martin Foundation. Good morning, Parker. Andrew, good morning. That peace walk just finishing up. Now we've got some speakers on stage. I'll take you live to the action here at this Trayvon Martin event that is well underway. A number of people coming out here today to Ives Estates Park in Northeast Miami-Dade for this event that is hosting uh, hundreds of people at this point and free food, a lot of different speakers here, some performances as well. And as you said, what makes this day so special is that today would have been Trayvon's 27th birthday and later this month, February 26th, yeah, would actually be 10 years to the day that the 17 year old was shot and killed. We got a chance to speak with some of the activists that came today along with some of the family members remembering Trayvon here today. In a day and time like this, we're we're still dealing with it and a whole lot of other things. So it just not about Trayvon, just so much that goes with this whole fight. Ten years later, right now I'm supposed to be taking Trey to the hole on that basketball court somewhere and probably working side by side with him right now because he's supposed to be right here standing with me right now today. But ten years later, he's not here. But I, you know what? I know God got, got him, got, got a soldier up there. He's probably doing the same thing I'm doing down here. Amen. Do you neighbor? Trayvon's uncle, one of many Let's people here to celebrate Trayvon's life this morning. You can take a live look again at some of the performances that are getting ready on the stage. You, this event happening until noon today. Again, a celebration of life for Trayvon Martin. For now, we are live I'll in Northeast Miami-Dade. I'm Parker Branton, Local 10 News.